What's up? How's everyone doing? Hope you're all well. D-Rock here, you first outdoors. Today I got Jenna North with me. And we're out in uh, Beaver Dam Mountains. We're actually coming in from the eastern side. And we're gonna attempt to bag Jarvis Peak. So I actually spent uh, a little while kind of scouting this because there really wasn't anything I could research online that really spoke about anybody doing this. I did find one. And it was just a brief mention of someone came up the south ridge. So I came at it from the north. North and I came at it from the west. And we've kind of settled on kind of southeastern ridge. Or what we're looking at is right behind us. There's this canyon right here. We want to go up right there. Because uh, on the map here, we're looking at Jarvis Peak here. We took a road in and walked up back here. And it was pretty sheer. So we came around. And we're gonna follow up one of these drainages to get to the peak. There's only gonna be maybe, I don't know, a thousand feet of elevation gain, maybe a little more. So, shouldn't be too rough, but uh, we don't know. It's definitely steep up there. We'll get up to the top and uh, we'll have a better idea of what we're doing. So, join us. All right, there's no trail. Just kinda, kinda head up. Get to the top of this here and see what we're dealing with. Over on the west side here, it's very sheer. And then coming over from the north, it looked like when I was scouting the other day that uh, you'd have some pretty deep canyons to get through. So this may or may not be, may or may not be the best route, but uh, we're gonna go up here and find out. Well, it's already a steep walk up. Uh, we've got two drainages here. I think we're just gonna go up the middle and it looks like there's a drainage up at the top, but it may not be much. Starting to really get a good view of uh, the Cliffs of Zion back here. Man, we got some. Wow. Yeah, these cams. <laughs> Dang. Man. Some time was put into those. Yeah, right through the gateway. So. Direct path, straight on up. really good view of Red Mountain right here and uh, just over to the left right in there that's the hellhole area and it's really cool because I've been trying to get a route up to the top and I can see the sheer cliffs and then they go sheer and then it's just this big huge wide flat area it looks really cool uh, just get up even more so just to the right here as you can see how we came up this middle point there's the drainage there's a drainage to the left drainage to the right came straight up the middle and then there's another big drainage right here so I think we can just roll up and it's going to drop a little bit and then we'll be able to go straight up at least that's how it kind of looked on the topo if I was looking at the right area, which I believe I was. Whew. No joke, it's a steep one. All right, Jen just crossed over and is now heading this route, this line. I put up a couple cairns here and there. This is the top of the peak that uh, 
we were looking up at the beginning of the, the hike there that we were making a direct line to, and we broke off to the left, or I guess you'd say west, and came around just shy of topping out on that. You see Jin's coming up over the ridge there. It's a steep and, uh, and I'm just kind of making a line now, coming up this and heading up towards the peak there. Topped out here, and this is not Jarvis Peak. Jarvis Peak is right there. Hmm. All right, so there is some exposed scrambling. It does make sense now. Get up this right here, that section. Right off in the distance here, you can see Scrub Peak. There's a communications tower on it. Yep, good to know. Good to know. So we topped out right here and the thing would be to go down this, come back up this, follow that ridge line around to the peak there. So that's definitely what you would call an exposed scramble. And it looks kind of a lot worse than it maybe is because we're standing opposite of it and it looks really sheer. It's pretty steep to me. Hmm. Oh, apparently there's more to this peak than I originally thought. All right, well, I'm gonna go have a look at this. Seems, uh, I think I can get down this right here. So, I'm gonna go as far as I feel I safely can. And uh, see what that looks like over there. It's doable. So there's a dirt road right over here. I drove this four wheel drive road. I came up here and walked up to this ridge yesterday and I had a look up coming here. This is all sheer wall around here. So I was thinking about a route up here, but uh, I don't know how bad this is getting up over here. Yeah, so this is all loose. Mm. I was wondering when the Exposed scrambling was going to come into play. It just, it just was going to be too easy. And now I realize what that 
trip report mint. Uh, especially looking over here. I don't think I could go around the right there and get up. I think it's too sheer. I just, I don't know. I'm on this spine now. And this is looking back. We topped out right there. I was able to down climb this. Not too much of a problem. What I'm worried about is this section here. Uh, it may not be as bad as I think it is. But it sure looks like a doozy. looks like it goes so uh, I'm gonna go down there and have a look now Jen and North are back up at the ridge here um, I just I uh, don't think it's wise to bring them down all this if we can't get up that and it might be too exposed to even attempt I'm just making sure this isn't loose So I might as well say I did bring, uh, I do have rope, I brought about 65 feet of rope, I got a harness, some webbing, a quick link. I could go up that and make a rappel to get down it if it's too sketch. So I don't know, I may make a run at this peak anyway. I kind of knew when we topped out back there that I had a feeling that wasn't going to be it. Uh, you know, you hope it is. <laughs> Sometimes just like, uh, but. Uh, I want to be aware of my time too. It's about one o'clock, so. Getting up there is just a walk over. I don't know. I don't even got time to do this. All right. I got down from this point. It wasn't too bad, actually. As I get closer to this, I'm looking at this here. It doesn't, you know, I gotta be honest with you. From this point right now, it doesn't seem to be as bad as I thought it'd be as I stood over there and looked. And yeah, steep it's yeah, but uh, I don't know. I'm at this, I'm at this saddle now. I'm gonna walk up this and see how gnarly this really gets. Well, now that I'm on the base, you know, uh, it doesn't seem so bad. Well, let's walk this a little bit. Maybe. Okay, so uh, Jen's hanging tight with North over on the ridge over here. I'm gonna go ahead and go up this ways and see uh, just how far I can get uh, safely. And I may attempt the peak. Uh, I think I can get there and decent enough time this this honestly doesn't look too bad now that I'm I'm on it uh, it's not as exposed as it looks at least this section oh.
Well, almost to the top of this. It's getting uh, kind of interesting. Uh, definitely class three. Uh, not, not too bad, really. Man, it sure looked a lot worse standing on that other peak. I don't really want to go on the edges. I want to see out to the sides. A little more protected that way. Well, it's happening. I top out here, I need to cut over. I'm worried about a cliff right there. I, I don't think there is. Part of me wants to skirt over under and go up, but uh, 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 there's a really drainage right there I'm worried about. I don't want to backtrack and waste time. I'm gonna go up and over. Okay, well. Now, uh, in a couple of the uh, exposed scramble spots, yeah. the support wasn't wrong. If I roll this way, trees will stop me. I'm gonna be just a hoot to figure out how to get back down. All right, we'll worry about that. I'll be back. Okay. I'm gonna start skirting the side now. See if I can get around this. I might be able to. Here's the peak we topped out on. I just crossed all this. There's this big drainage here. I'm getting across here pretty easy. I'm also marking my route so I can come down and get this. So, <sighs> leaving breadcrumbs, so to speak. This, is, uh, this isn't bad coming across right here. And so far I didn't have to uh, continue on up to the top. It is getting, getting interesting. A little too tight. Wow. That's it. I made it through that section. Right up there. Oh, I'm getting there, folks. I'm getting there. I'm gonna peek right over there. Jen's over here at this peak. She stopped there with North. That's gonna be a fun return trip. So, 
We end up this surprisingly fast. And there are a couple of uh, interesting moments that I'll have to deal with coming back. That's it, man. I just gotta walk over there. So this is looking down the western part of this. It's pretty sheer. Uh, it's no bueno. All right, I'm gonna cut over and follow the ridge line on up. And uh, man, that better be our peak. All right, just as a note, coming up, you did not have to top out. I cut over right about there, I'd say. And I marked it, I carried it really well, just so I can uh, know where to go on the return trip. And at this point, I think it uh, should be, it's a fairly easy walk over to the peak here. A few more steps. Alright. Final steps. Jarvis Peak, there's the thing. We did it. Woo! 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 All right. West Mountain Peak. Red Mountain down there. Pine Valley Mountains, Zion. Oh. Right over there, Scrub Peak. Beyond that, Virgin Peak. Ooh. Ooh. There you have it, folks. Jarvis Peak. Jen's down here. This peak here, I cover all this different distance in an hour and a half. I can't stay up here too long, the sun's getting low. So, um, I have something to drink, roll bar, and I gotta get back. Let's do a little 360 though. Starting with uh, West Mountain Peak there. from Jarvis Peak. Spectacular. Yeah! <laughs> oh man. Very nice. There's Moapa Peak. Off in the distance there. A nice edge. Whew! That was a mean one. <sighs> Initially, I scouted. When I came down West Mountain, I took this road here. And it's uh, right about there. It gets serious four-wheel drive road. And I rode it all the way up in here uh, looking for a route up. And none of it looked too good because this is just all sheer right here. But uh, there may be a way to get up here. And then we scouted from down here the other day. 
and I think the route that uh, that we took up may be the best route. Not for certain, but uh, you know, we got up. <laughs> Let's see what we got here. Okay. Last document in here was November 16, 2018. Prior to that was November 10th. There's been a few people up here recently. <laughs> yeah, all right. Gotta put our in there. D Rock. What's the date? Twelve, sixteen, eighteen. You first outdoors. Sweet. Sorry, I just chucked some water. The views are absolutely fantastic from up here. The walk uh, was interesting. Pretty easy up here, and then you got this stretch, which uh, definitely got some class three scrambling. I wouldn't maybe say class four, but uh, they are definitely, there's a couple exposed spots. Uh, I'll record some of it going back down. I'm not, I'm not gonna really record this ridge line running back, but when I get to that, straight down section yeah it gets interesting for sure so uh starting to get a little chilly up here they're waiting for me down there so i got a couple pictures good to go sign the uh the register there all right let's get back down this one all right i'm back on my cairn route and i'm just gonna head on back down to over here and get down so i'm getting down quick And I marked this really good, this traverse over from that point. So uh, there's more of my cams there. So just stay on my line and go down the way I came up. Oh, there's another. I was making cams pretty frequently. So there's another one. Another one. That looks familiar. I think I come up through that. <sighs> kind of looks like it, doesn't it? Huh. Yeah. <laughs> I remember, there are some uh, nice, good old fashioned wish hogging moments. Sure, whatever I'm grabbing on isn't loose. Looks like I climbed over that.
over I think this is way way steep get into. Right, that's not so bad. I'm going to get down there and cross over. Definitely didn't come up this, but roll this a little bit down. God, I could probably go. over to the left a little bit. I got it's getting a little a little too much on that side. Oh so we're still making our way down. Let's uh, try this side for a second. It's definitely Too much farther and I'm in that little saddle so that's good news all right I've made it down to the saddle nice now I just hike all the way back up that snap and was uh coming up and down this is uh uh interesting there's some class three in that for sure there's a couple spots that uh it wouldn't have been a good thing if i rolled so uh bear that in mind getting up this shouldn't be a problem so wasting our time let's just get this over with it's a nice little Climb back up after all that crap. Ay, ay, ay. Taking my way back. This stuff. That's my final climb right up this. Hell, <sighs> can there. there we go. Way up. Oh. <sighs> 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 
One more push up this. And I'm done. I'm topped out. Uh, it's not getting out. That's it. I don't have to go any, any higher. Oh, y'all did make some cairns, huh? Wow. That was pretty sweet. Woo! Appreciate y'all waiting for a little bit. Oh. All right. It's all downhill now. That's awesome. We're just going down the same way we came up, so really no need to record that but uh that section over there it gets interesting so that was jarvis peak and we just got to get all the way down to the drainage and the road right there and Made it down from all the way up there. I think uh, Jarvis was a little more than I anticipated. That uh, interesting section. There's the old truck down there. So that was uh, whew, uh, a little involved, but uh, it was a great peak to summit. Wasn't as easy as West Mountain, that's for sure. All right, folks, that was Jarvis Peak. A nice walk up with some interesting points, that's for sure. We appreciate you watching. Stay safe out there. Support for the channel is greatly appreciated. So if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. That's it. We'll see you next time. D Rock out. Chin out. North out. Adios.